This is Obina Show Live. Karibuni sana. Thank you so much for creating time to be with us. Kwa wale wenye wameingia for the first time, this happens 9 p.m. Mondays and Tuesdays. Sometimes on Wednesdays, depending on the mood and the vibe. But kwa wale ambao wamezoea hapa, karibuni viti zenyu ziko tayari, eh, sharubati ko tayari, <laughs> enjoy. We are still broadcasting live from Yale 72 Lounge in Lovington. They are our hosts. Sisi ukuja hapa because the ambiance the ambiance eh, okay, Miale, 72 lounge you get some private space you get some amazing food you get free parking na pia kuna kawa so labda unataka kufika kawa unataka kule unataka kufanya kama mkutano nini this is the best place to be if you're having a birthday party or any other event that you want to do ama ni sherehe tu unataka kupiga Miale 72 lounge is the best place to be as obina tv tunawashukuru sana kwa ile support umetushikilia maze tunasonga and this episode is now international niliwaambia tumeanza so the gentleman that I am talking to tonight is no longer just a local artist. Sio mtu wa Rumba, sio mtu wa Lenga na Malanga, sio mtu ni mtu ametoka mali netwa Australia. The land of the kangaroos. Ladies and gentlemen, the one and only Juguno. Yes, yes. Tindi 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 tindi. Yes, sir. Okay, siniaje? Niko fiti. Uko salama? Mimi niko sawa. Ah, guru be here manze. Kitu ndio kubwa. Kitu ndio kubwa. No, you deserve it. It's a throne, bro. Ah, it's a throne. It's a throne, yeah. Throne at me. Bro. Eh, uko kwaje tangu tu wala. Eh, ba kuna. Onge wachi bwana. Hakuna, inatoka wapi? Unajua you can take a man from the bush but you cannot take the bush from the village. Like hakuna village inatoka. Atu mazema? You can take the village from a man but you cannot take the bush from the village. Kitu kama hiyo. Like uwezi toa kuna vile tu mtu akona nini yake sisi watu waocha kutengeneza ni ngumu. Huko tu huko na accent? Ai wapi? Tena wiki moja natoa pia accent ya wiki moja. Ai si uongo hata mimi ni watch two movie Netflix. What's up bro? What's pop? Alafu ki watch movie nyingine inaisha kama ile kuna ile ilikuwa ya nini? Brave. Ilikuwa gani ile ya UK? Nili watch kabla nienda UK? Yes. Brave. Kuna ile movie ya Brave. Sijui inaitwa je Bad Boy or something. Boy something ilikuwa Netflix. So walikuwa naongea hiyo Brave. Wait. By the time unaenda juu kushuka imeisha. So accent haikuja. Ngile uko nayo ni ile ya kuzaliwa nayo. Hiyo okay. atelele atelele. Hiyo <laughs> ndio haitwangushangi. Okay, apart from Besha, ni nini umetoka na international? Ngi, ngi, okay. Uh, apart Watu from Watu wanatoka na accent na pesa nini? Fridge mo? magnet. Ah. Ile ya kuchorwa ya fridge wewe uko nayo, niko oh, nayo okay, Australia. Okay, okay sawa. Eh, sasa hiyo ndio niliona. Unajua sasa mtu akikuja kwa gioni nini ulileta ni eh. fridge magnet? fridge magnet eh, unajua hiyo hata ni kitu unaweza buy nini <laughs> okay hata jeje au kendo wizi nataka ya australia yeah what is it that you saw in australia mm. that you haven't seen in kenya i think one the kangaroo kuna kitu kanaitwa koala koala ni kama kamse kameva koala ni ka ebu ukipata hiyo picha koala ni kama kamtu kako kameva blanketi kako na blanketi alafu koala bear koala inaitwa koala ni bear yeah. actually it's a bear but it's a small bear Mm-hmm. But bear in mind is like a human being. <laughs> Koala, <laughs> hey, you didn't need this guy. Because ilikuwa ilikuwa ni kitu sijawahi ona no ya Koala na zionanga kwa picha but when you get ina kaineza kuchapia story. Oh. <laughs> ina kaineza kuchapia story. Eh hey, unasemaje? <laughs> so, for, for me what I saw it's Koala and, and, and also the vastness of the land. Unaona vile sisi town wetu ni ha. Yeah. Unaenda town kama Roiro ni ha. Ukitoka kidogo umetoka Roiro. Yeah kila kitu iko pamoja so i think um, it, it's it's a vast they yeah. have space eh? yeah they have space and, and also the fact that um, it's 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 far ai miss jai enda safari hivyo <laughs> ile safari ndefu nilienda hivyo ni wakati 2000 and 0, 2000 wakati eldoret express zilikuwa zinaenda eldoret na barabara iko imetengenezwa <laughs> unajua safari muka muka unaenda mpaka mnaoga unafika uoge kitambo safari liko unaenda Mwacheni ya pumziki ametoka safari. Eh. Sikuizi unatoka safari kama umejinja kuku. Siku hiyo hizo zilikuwa safari. So mnasimamishwa mpaka mjisaidie. Yeah, it used to so, be. So I, I think that was one of my longest flights I've ever had. How long is it to Australia? So from Australia we had a layover from Australia to Qatar it was um to Qatar is 14 like four hours. From Kenya to Qatar sasa like natoka. Four, sasa natoka. Oh. Eh natoka sasa Australia. Oh unarudi. Eh unajua kurudi sasa nikupanda. <laughs> 
<laughs> I didn't know. Kuna milima. Kupanda kwenda ni mteremko. Ni sasa tulipanda Qatar. Qatar kupanda ni for for some five, four, four, few five, minutes, yeah. uh, four five hours. Then leo basijua how long. Then sasa kutoka Qatar kuteremka mpaka Australia is around 14 hours. Kwa ndege? Eh. Yeah. Unaka hivi unaamka una stretch 2 hours. Unaonanga tu leo watu wanaanza kutembea tembea kwa ndege. Eh mnapata mpaka tu leo vitu tukulala. Na hauona usingizi. <laughs> unaanza kuona watu wenyi. Yaani unaamka mnaletewa chakula. By the time unashuka haujui mwili nataka breakfast but wanakula lunch. 14 hours. Mchanganyiko unachanganyikiwa juu sasa mwili inajua ni breakfast. Hai ni breakfast. Lakini wana serve dinner. Cuz I think it's 8 hours. Wako 8 hours mbere. So huko mmeenda dinner huko na inapaka. Mtoka breakfast, breakfast mnafika. Ah, mchanganyiko. Mimi kuna siku tumeamka usiku kutafuta chakula. Sasa usiku ya huko, juni range huko. <laughs> watu wetu hawako na hiyo ni kazi ya watu wetu. Then the time difference huko is crazy because you find there's already that times difference ya 8 hours, but ukienda in a different state because you are going to four different states. Ukienda in a different state, iko 2 hours nyuma ya hii, meaning iko 6 hours ah. mbele ya huko home. Unapata so, Nairobi saa saba, ukifika Kisumu eh, unapata umerudi nyuma uko eh, saa asubuhi. Eh, so unapoteza tulipoteza wakati. Mnasemanga Kenya mnapoteza wakati. Eh. Ai uko tulipoteza wakati. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> unapoteza alafu unarudishiwa. Sasa hiyo ndio uzuri wake. Ukirutoka huku alafu urudi sasa si utarudishiwa. Unapata sasa kule wako mbele. Ai umetuchanganya hapo kidogo. Nasema si huo anaruka mwaka mbele yetu. Wanaruka mwaka na 8 hours. Australia huwa anaruka mwaka mbele. Sijaipo I don't know. Ndio nasema sina kuambia. Huwa <laughs> wanaruka huko. Ndio nipiga mimi sina kuambia. Nakwambia sina kuambia. Wanaruka na, na, na eight hours mbele yetu. Yeah. So unaonaga pua pua saa zile huko ni saa mbili atemna jitalisha kuruka mwaka. Tuna rukia wapi Australia washaruka. Na Ethiopia. <laughs> Ethiopia nao wanaongojea wako wako calendar sijui ya 2020. Okay. Oh okay that's nice. Mm. Na nini uh, UK what did you see in the UK that um, you haven't seen? Eh hey, UK Kenya. electric cars. Kule gari unachaji kama simu. Shua. Sasa hapa kwetu wazilete. <laughs> Sima inapotea ile ya saa tatu. <laughs> na ulikuwa unaenda kazi. <laughs> ni watu wanunue power bank. Sorry boss nimechelewa eh, siku charge gari. Eh, uko apparently ukinunua electric imepunguzwa tax. So wana encourage a lot of uh, green energy and what not so there is a lot of electric. It was so beautiful man. Yeah, but nikijua tu vitu ziko huko haziwezi wa home. Unaona gari Yeye ni mavitu niliona huko gari ziko na kamera ya in case kuna accident inakacha inapiga unaona vile accident happen tunatoka nje kupiga eh kaja usisonge acha acha tubondane gari zinaendelea kubondana mpige picha watu hawezi pita huko ni kacha ikigonga venye ya bagi yatoka automatic isha eh sorry mate juu hiyo isha afika kwa insurance wamejua ni nini sasa mtaenda tu mtoe file siku fulani dakika fulani niligongwa nini ili happen na wana sort hapa ni msimame mkesi mtu kanane unajua bwana yangu ni nani wewe yeah. upigie mtu wako wa insurance yeah. amegoga demi akwambie usikubali makosa <laughs> na ni wewe kwa makosa wewe ndio bali ni wewe kugonga usikubali don't accept don't accept na asisongeshe gari wewe umepata watu ndani ya club so ah so i think uh, but but yote tisa kumi you still miss home unakaanga tu hivyo like sawa iko sawa but mimi nataka tu kwenda. Mnataka tu hiyo gari yani. Mimi mngoje nenda America. Si rudi. Uko sure? Ai. Hapana, ina depend pia. Atu unakaa hivi unasema mm. when you, with the technology in mm. the UK. Mm. Then you look then you say I miss home at ugali. Mimi na miss vumbi. Unajua kuna nini wewe yani? <laughs> au miss nini ya home bana? <laughs> una feel tu na umeanza kuhata home. Unajua hata kitanda kuna video kitanda ya home ndio tu kitanda. Ushajaribu hata kulala wapi? Yeah. Unalanga unalala tu usiku ipite. Yeah. Lakini una ukienda home unajiekelea anga unalalanga. Sijui wewe unalalanga aje lakini mimi yako imekujua. Mura la hivi namba 4. Naitanga namba 4. Unalala mguu mmoja hivi. Sina alafu unaingiza nini hapa katikati? Hua. Ah ah hiyo wewe asifanye. Nasema hiyo namba 4. Hapana hey. namba 4 unalala hivi. Ndio yako hiyo namba 7. Watu wengi huwa hapana namba 4. Hii mguu inaenda mbele. Unalala hivi. Wacha kufanya hizo vitu kwa kipindi. Hiyo ni namba 4 nimelala. Ah ah hiyo ni mama. Hiyo ni namba 7. But point nilikuwa nakwambia kitanda ya nyumbani ndio kitanda you by the when mm. you normally come back home your bed welcomes you eh. una feel na kuidentify na kunguni ah iko sawa wapi wewe mm. wao mayu mwana kunguni vizuri mm. kuna nini tulikuwa theka theka nimeenda internship <laughs> internship yangu ilikuwa Kenya News Agency sasa theka mimi sijaiona triple decker mimi nimezoea double decker theka tukaenda hostel eh, Mrs. Washira amechukua nyumba za kukodisha kazifanya hostel 
sasa zilikuwa tu tu si ni tatu zingo ni tatu rumu ni kama turumu alafu nje tuko na cho unaongea na kikuyu pole na jaribu kujieleza unajua na fikiria na kikuyu wewe unafikiria ngaje by the way mimi fikiria kwanza na kikuyu lugha ya mama english english yes omera bwana hapana mimi nafikiria na lugha ya mama na translate Kiswahili alafu english if need be okay sasa alikuwa tumejazana hivi mpaka watu wa health walikuja tumejazana sasa bed bug mimi sijui zitoka wapi na hako kakitu kana kumanga kana jificha inakuuma hauwezi ipata hata uchome hiyo mattress hauwezi ipata zili tukura unafinya kitu unasikia inanuka fani mi hapo ndio nilionea bed bug <laughs> unajua kuna vile kuwa kananuka ukikaguza kananuka eh, alafu kana hepa so mnajikuna nyinyi wote you are like hey, kuna ugonjwa huku it's inaambukizana in, in, in ya kujikuna <laughs> held walikuja huko mosquito eh, kumbe hata hiyo nini sio ni nifo mwanzo tulikuwa watu wengi But anyway. kuna lala pat gani juu katikati chini katikati saa kila mtu huyu amechukua juu na huyu chini sasa huyu mse wa katikati anaaga siku ana form unajua huwezi relax kwa bed wewe katikati na wachini unajua kuna ile umekaa hivi wachini at least akataka hivi sasa katikati unakaa katikati unakaa hivi unahanga tulikuwa tunalala kama kama ndege kama nyonde jugush karibu sana ubina show live unajua hata tujaanza show lakini sasa tushapiga story sasa tuanze show haya tuanze show thank you so much for honoring the invite and creating time thank you for having me ubina thank you so much yeah you you are doing an amazing job on putting the kenyan content on the international map. Mm. We've had a few people try mm. but somehow kwa kuna kashida. We mm. always have a even our music. Mm. We try going international kidogo mm. tunarudi tu hapa. Mm. Tunaenda hivi something mm. is happening. And then mm. when I saw what you what you are doing mm. before you even went to the UK mm. you started local. Mm. Kafanya. Mm. Eh. And then unajua kuna wale watu wa Ah it mm. happen. Mm. Inafanya inapigwa mm. it happens. Mm. Like oh it's already happened. Mm. Then next is going and then you mm. kept on going and going and going. Mm. Good stuff. Mm. So we're going to talk about all that we mm. find out how it came about. Mm. TTNT mm. how it started and everything. Mm. Mm. But kwa wale wenyewe hajaona episode yangu na wewe kwa kula kula mm. show mm. tuwapatie tu simple recap. Mm. Jugusha anatoka wapi? How did you end up in content creation because initially Timo mm. mm. hakukuwa content creator. Mm. Yes. Mimi nilifanya journalism at Kenya Institute of Mass Communication. I'm supposed to be a very nice journalist. Nafaa kuwa kila lima do fulani. Ah uh, but uh, nilishia kutangaza mali mali. So I did journalism at Kenya Institute of Mass Communication. The Kenya hiyo shule tukaanza utangazaji kama vile ate watu wanafanyanga maadva tapa. Sijui who and who was in Kenya in sijui what university. Well, KMC tukifanya itakuwa series. A lot of people are there. Akina Hussein Mohamed, Akina Fred Ndimuli, Ferdinand Mondi we ataja ninakupatia a lot of people are in KMC so i was uh, one of those people tulikuwa KMC and uh, i thought i would be a journalist so nikachapa journalism si ndio maana hata nafanya kazi huko the kadeka kwa district information officer Kenya news agents it didn't happen so i got a chance to act in hapakule news and um, real house helps so that's how i came to act because i used to act before nikiwa hata kole that's the time sasa tunapiga a lot of drama drama festivals a colleges sayo zilikuwa universities and college kabla waziharibu zikuwa sasa za universities and college juu university hakuna drama wanapiga colleges ndio drama ilikuwa inapigwa halelo sasa hiyo time ilikuwa kemkem juu sisi wote tulikuwa pamoja na sasa waligawanyisha ikakuwa university ziko kando college ziko kando so mnaendaga mashindano college kando hiyo kitambo ilikuwa tertiary zote ziko pamoja Muna Muna imagine umepatana na NYS dance NYS hakuna kitu tukona juala sana mkaga 3 kupiga tizi dance na vijiko ikifika hapa <laughs> manzi wa hemi sisi manzi tunafika aye 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 muna fai pande juu hakuna dance gani <laughs> NYS wanakupigia harmony na wana dance na unajua ni ngumu kupiga boot hapa na wajaba boot wewe ni NYS dance. ni dance kwani mna dance ingine uniform walikuwa na dance aje boki watu wa high school mungu wa mnadan na uniform si Apana, costume costume exactly na owalo but hakuna owalo hakuna owalo ya viatu bwana <laughs> ni hizo ma, ni masai so na nini uh-huh. na zile ma, kuna zingine za waluya zile za hivi uh-huh. na kuchorwa chorwa eh alafu ni barefoot oh, alafu okay. wanakupigia manzo wanakata height mm. anachapa hivi bro <laughs> na harmony bado inatoka kwa hii mdomo na anakatika <laughs> Munaimba kama waenda wazimu unaenda kama wa levi nao um, so kwa drama nilikuwa tukiwa KMC but uh, for me that wasn't um, something I'd go commercial with 
mimi yangu ilikuwa nataka manzi mpaka nilikuwa nasoma news eh jumla ya watu 200 mimi wameweza kupatikana ah jumla ya mimi yani unasoma gazeti bila utakuwa ukipresent news acha kucheka kasia acha kucheka nilikuwa najua nitakuwa news presenter lakini jua alijugush there some things you just think by yourself and say this one unaona haikui na wewe wangu niambia nobody told you hakuna waliniambia kwa sababu na utakuwa mkali hata wananiambia college do more practice kumbe wananiambia bado hapo eh iko saba endelea lakini fanya practice So I did practice ya jumla ya watu 199 na tisa until I got a chance to work in hapa kule news and then um after hapo ilikuwa a lot of success because it was supposed to be an extra I was supposed to be an extra then after the extra ikakuwa where it's extra 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 So ikakuwa tutafikia mzee jina So sina jina wase YouTube wasema kuna yako kamse kuna yako kamse so nikatajaribu kutafuta jina when we were shooting tulikuwa na shootia pale Church Road kuna place eh kutoka Kenya kiteremka hivyo hapo niko na shuti hapo so tunatafuta jina manzi na tafuta jina kali yenye haijai tumeona msee kama eh Alejandro yani jina tu itakuwa yangu una get <laughs> sasa tukakosa so we spent like 10 minutes tutafuta jina director akasema ai alikona to idaka mko akasema guys let's shoot tutatafuta jina baadaye yeah, jina atatupata mbele tuki roll tu hivi action taxi driver alikuwa hapo nyuma akitana we jogona ukaalia gari <laughs> <laughs> Alikuwa anaita best yake anaitwa Jogona. Ah tukasema like... si hii tuende na hii. Haya tukaenda na Jogona. Sasa kusema mimi naitwa Jogona wasa wakai twist wakasema bila Jogona ni refu. So wase kwa, kwa YouTube wakaanza kusema Jugush. Ah Jugush leo ah wapi Jugush leo alikuwa wapi as we went on with the episode. So that's where jina Jugush ilikam. Then tukiendelea yani life yangu inakuwa na mistakes mingi. Tukiendelea kuna nini nilikuwa na introduce kama Mkorino. So kuna mkurino napenda sana anaimba nyimbo za kigosha anaitwa Heze Heze Dungu. So nilikuwa tunaita Muratina Project Fame baada ya Tasca Project Fame. So nikatafuta jina baada ya Hezekia Dungu nikajita Heze Hezekia Chukuna. Hezekia Chukuna. Sasa nikijintroduce kumoja nikasema Heze Kainzi kakapita hapa. Nikasema Heze Kia Chukuna. Then naikapita so nikamwambia ayo mearibu let's do it again Hezekia Chukuna. When we are editing na Abel Mutua hiyo clip ka play wa ile ya mistake so ikachezwa heze kia jukuna Abel ako e burudi kwa hiyo a a hii tulitoa a a rudi heze maze kutoka hiyo siku nilikuwa na jinsi rudi kwa mmoja anaitwa heze kia sasa ana badala yangu anambia e burudi ile kitu yako ya hivi a hiyo basa ilikuwa blanda eh ilikuwa blanda so after hapo hapa kule ikashika ikashika tukaleta kipindi naitwa Abel Mutua akakuja alikuwa na concept deadly sana ya mambot vile B- because when you stay home job yetu inatua lao tunaka home wakati watu wengine wameenda kazi uh, kama hapa sasa hii unafanya kazi usiku sasa kiasha mchana unasikia hiyo story yes. unasikia vile jirani sijui alifanya hizo story ni tamu unajua unajifanya anga unaosha gari lakini uko hivi <laughs> tunajua baba na hawa wako pangi wakipiga hawajua ki wako loud wanapiga eh eh jana nilimpikia supu na sausage eh. alikataka na sausage so hizo stories zilikuwa tamu so abeli alikuwa na hiyo idea ya is a story what happens you are ni wasa tujai tell story yao yet they see kama kuna wasa wanatujua ni yao so in terms of how people live so that's how real house came to be abel akasema let's do the first episode ndani hapa kule news it blew ika blow wasa na episode 2 iko so it had the nini jo abel alikuwa amefikiria kwa mbele akasema hii iko na potential kwa kipindi peke yake so that's how now from hapa kule news we went to real house njugusha kaendelea so i was on two vipindis After a while, while one of four episodes Abel akaandika Philip uh, director aka direct um, um, story katokea and long story short ikakatizwa so here i am nimetoka jo Abel mtu ametoka so what do i do niko na followers 14000 on that is in 24 no 2015 so uh, Abel mtu aliko no i think 2015 ikikuja kuisha so Abel ametoka sasa mimi nitafanya nini si hata mimi nitoke kwa nini niko na nini si nitoke mmoja alikuwa anaandika onyesha na mmoja alcreate character baby ya njugush amejiondoka si ni mvua maybe yako na mazuri kumbe ana <laughs> jamaa ana form <laughs> akipotea unapotea na yeye jamaa ana form nika huru <laughs> ana ana form hey. haya <laughs> rusha tu mawe sasa <laughs> rusha kabisa mawe hiyo <laughs> si mtaweka nini mtabana anaisha mm. <laughs> hanta fanya mambo yako sasa <laughs> ana shout <laughs> umeza watu kwa line namkira huko mzaza eh nitadie wacha let water down that nini sasa eh tulikuwa wapi na nini umefuata eh, abel 
Eh yeah, kumbe have belana form. So that's why I decided unicorn idea nimekuwa nikiandika very short clips zenye zingi pia kwa TV because then I was writing for hapa kule news. So juu tushatoka niko na ideas zilikuwa nipeleke kwa kipindi si tuzifanya tu. So that's when tukaanza ku shoot on theme. But mainly nilikuwa na shoot juu Uh, you, you know when you have passion for something you just put it up wase wa cheeky wana nice so that's what we did and um, without knowing tukafika 20000 uh, followers on Instagram by then Instagram ulikuwa na post 15 seconds so tukaekelea pale soon like a video alafu naiharakisha point na fika home so lazima 15 seconds uchape ikaenda hivyo ikakuwa 1 minute so tukiwa katika hii harakati tukiwa 20000 uh, followers on Instagram msia kakam akatwambia ni aje nataka mfanye hivi muni tangazia kipindi yangu i mean my product kwa video zenu i'm like how do you do that ah nataka tu iweke ama useme walaye alafu sinalipa ah are you serious sasa hiyo niko na areas tuko na areas nishaoa niko na wife lakini hatuna hatujalipa nini tuko na areas ya 50000 ya rent ulifikaje areas ya 50000 kwa mko mnaishi wapi si ruko na ruko roiro sasa nile unalipa nusu na bakisha nusu inaongezeka na furia hii mwezi. So okay good we. Sasa so sinasikia tuko na 50,000. So mse akapiga akauliza sasa juu mnafanya video na nawalipa mna charge how much? Hatujawahi charge. Tukakumbuka tuko na deni how much? 50. 50. Tukamwambia tupatie 50,000. Akatwambia sasa mtafanya tutafanya video kumi. <laughs> au <laughs> kila video ilikuwa 5k. Eh akatutumia 5k akatwambia fanyeni hizo video. Alafu nitamalizia. Utangojea? Tunaenda tukanunua modem sasa hiyo hakukuwa na wifi, tukanunua modem na mrembo. Tuna shoot tuna shoot na simu, tuna edit ya tu hapo. Tunaekelea manzi tulishoot video kumi tukaekelea. Mpaka wale uja maja ilipa. Hiyo 45 ilibaki. <laughs> Ni nani huyo? Hiyo 5k ilipwa tukapatia landlord tukama bia goja 45 wewe. Inakuja. Goja 45. Tulikuwa tunalipa hivyo na alikuwa mzuri manzi alikuwa haina shida. Haina shida. Na vile tulimuita harusi akaona vile tumejionyesha harusi kuu. <laughs> Alikuwa most understanding landlord ever. So akakamata kumbe haina shida. Mimi hata nisiwaitishi. Si nije mnaniletea. Eh so um, after hapo it, it hit me if this guy was willing to pay 50k yeah. na tuko na 20,000 what if tuki hit one mic. Kambia sele kile tutafanya tuchape hizi video. Tuchape goal si tupate wase wanalipa goal ni tuongeze ndio yule mzee akakaa kulipa tunyoroshe juu kama huyu alikuwa atoe 50k do you know kwa kipindi the first time nililipo ilikuwa 500 bob per episode na hiyo mnashoot a whole day hii ni clip nimeshoot na wana wa nika edit nikatuma well modem ni waste nilituma na like 3 hours juna nini na deplete tunaongeza ina deplete tunaongeza so so um eh hey, muongea sana so <coughs> So that's how we got into digital. Yeah. yeah. Wow, it's been a roller coaster. Mm. Uh, I've always wanted to know. Mm. You and Wakavinye mm. when when you're doing most people started knowing Jugush on digital mm. as Jugush na Wakavinye mm. mm. because Wakavinye had a kavit. She's purely on digital from digital Wakavinye. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. She she was Nani from there. Na nikona via Aja zinaweza kosa kunotisi kama nzima. Wake wake up wake up aji wao. Wake up. Kiatu na ni kali guys. Look in Australia. Kwa ni gambut. Eh? Si acha kuharibu we gambut yeko na we hana au ushaiona gambut iko na wait hapo. Sorry. Unajua saa zile umedunga ndio upatanagi na maex. Lakini saa zile umechaka maze unapatana. Wake up video for the, for the rest of your life. Ah anasema saa zile umengala ndio upatanagi na watu mlikuwa mnasoma nao. Saa zile umechapa ndio kai akio bina wa. Nimekutana na ubina. Manzi kimemwele. Guys tunafuata mchangi. Sasa <laughs> unasikia eh eh wewe focus yeah, come so, back here come yeah. back here mm. <laughs> so you and Wakavinye uh, the whole thing happened mm. you've done content for a while you mm. even got married mm. but now just for content Kwa ni married ni content no 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 i'm saying you've you've done content for a while and you even got married you even got how married. is marrying coming into content si probably content led into marriage apana okay to end it yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. so has it ever gotten to a point where when mm. Wakavinye will say ah ah atufa fanya content pamoja Like, like just muka uh, disagree mm. on work um, I, i think it's in the initial stages where nilikuwa because what what happened is ndio celeste na ingia kwa kwa clips uh, niko at this point nimeacha tv yeah. then everyone is like um, si tunataka kufanya tv so um, we 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 uh, alikuwa ananishikia kamenje yeah. ananiuliza maswali mzee kwa nini umekaa hivyo yeah. na mimi so anani prompt juu my kind of comedy it's situation 
Yeah. Eh umepatikana uko hivi jitete. Yeah. So she used to hold the camera anauliza maswali then with time I was like I needed someone so that nikimskuma ika even funny. So I tried reaching out to my guys eh. Au kuna mtambo. Niendelea mani mani. Wanataka kuona from the front. Sasa hiyo ni ya home. Eh. Sasa walio nyumbani. So it it reached to a point where um I I needed someone to work with. So everyone I reached out to mwenye angenifanya relevant juu sasa hiyo nilikuwa naona manzeni didimia manzeni kwa mtandao kila mtu wako kwa TV naambia wako kwa TV kama ni work pamoja at least eh, nipate hiyo bado niko wananiambia hawezi like hey, italeta shida kwa TV <laughs> that was the most you know, nonsensical you know, thing to say my contract on TV e, bro, imagine na kuita tufanya video na niambia TV itakaa oh, they say it even until now bro unajua mazee ah kwende let's water down that <laughs> sasa yeah. nikasema ni sawa and that's the reason why mpaka wa leo <coughs> Celestine will always be in my con because hiyo time nilijaribu kila mtu manzi hakuna mtu alikuwa anakubali na Celest just the then was they are like tunataka kuona mwenye kwa nyuma yako menje selea kaka then tukapiga tukapiga manzi kaweza so for me that has been a working formula so the most difficult time mimi na yeye ilikuwa hiyo time juu yeye alikuwa taki camera hataki mimi sitaki hiyo mambo mimi nitaongea wewe unini hataki so until it became to it came to sasa yeye kukuja in front of the camera yeah. akakuja tukamiko akavinye akavinye liko from the cavit because you guy my guy you guy you have a cavinye you guy sasa ikakuwa ni wakavinye so now wakavinye is a, is, a, is a product of digital purely digital, digital. Yeah. yo yo kasirika sana yo mungu kasirisha yo mungu kasirisha yo choka na wewe sometimes mm. kuna kitu unaweza fanya kwa bia we any yeah. shoot hizo vitu huko tunaongea kitu serious alafu namwambia niko na kia tu mpya So <laughs> yeah but but I think uh, it's it's very human but um, uh, it's very it's very human kukasirika oh oh kuna mesikia nimesema aje human bana you are in Australia bro eh <laughs> nakubali tu UK bro unajua maybe huko ndio wanasemanga hivyo yeah. mm. but hawaya eh. wakavinya has been with you for how long now to limit uh, 20 20 You are industry So kama maybe singe kuwa what I'm doing to end up either kwa the same studio the same media house the same whatever so that's why it's easier to do what we do together because yeye akona technical know how of what she's doing alikuwa kia hii ana edit zile vitu za drama ah hey hey hizo za no yes sasa ndio alikuwa na edit na edit ni ni mrefu mrefu so ameiva anamaliza hiyo anaingia play for 45 minutes anamaliza hiyo anaenda corvus so in essence the reason why we were working together in from inception is because she did that in college yeah yeah na mimi nimefanya kila nafanya uigizaji for a very long time so i needed someone you mean nilifanya journalism so journalism we were not heavy on on behind the scenes yeah. we were not really heavy on the camera so msema ni kwa jama tatu eh jama tatu takriban watu 10 wamefariki so i i i eh i was not heavy on on technical so she was very heavy on technical she still is Um, and even now when we are let's say for example tunaikisha equipment she knows what kind of an equipment we need so that's why it's easier for her to be up hata anaweza sema pana that angle mm. no 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 shoot from uh, this side and anasema kwa nini hiyo headroom iko hivyo i'm like si bora naonekana sema kichwa and then now mm, mm. fast forward mm. the first baby came through mm. i've seen a couple of contents for uh, mm. of him mm. and i feel aje yeye utaka kufanya the last time tulishoot as kumbuki ni lini so that time ilikuwa covid yeah then he 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 was saying some crazy things alikuwa anasema anga tuna daddy i was just like this boy is so even today he says but wezi mtoa shule alafu kuja weka bag chini au sitoa uniform acha to record like for him it's a different kind of 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 content if i may may say that because yake hata a lot of time utasikia tukisema juni kitu acha sema ebu sema vile umesema then anarudia cause I'd live I say tunaipata gaiki wa moto. Ati una record mm-hmm. anasema kitu ah hiyo kata sasa ah ah. It's anasema kitu you are like muna cheka kwanza alafu you like guys you won't believe what he said. So um so, so for him it's not scripted. Yeah. Um th- then that time ilikuwa covid and I figured why not? 
if i had the chance if my dad had the chance ya ku introduce kwa what ah, i yeah. do now eh yeah. manzeni ningekuwa mbali kwa beta ningekuwa mbali sana but now you see you have to kila kitu unajitafutia wewe wewe unajitafutia tunafanya try and error you get so that was then but then aka grow up akaenda chuo sasa time hakuna ya ku record so unless now during holidays mna record amefanya nini holiday guys want more of him <laughs> yeah and nayo path yake you never know i know but when we can jupia wezi mtoa class kiketeke ya kuja afanye no, no, nini no, no, yeah. no, 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 so whenever we can we'll always do and, yeah. and we also do some small snippets kama juzi alisema <laughs> aliona rezo kwa tv akasema na nika anafanya ngani akasema na ongeanga which is true so <laughs> I, 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 <laughs> <laughs> but hawezi mfos if he chooses yeah. well and good but as i said mainly not because of anything but because of shule okay mm. what what does he want to do does he want to do content ama ako na path different maybe ni footballer yeah leo anataka football kesho anataka skating kesho anataka ballet anataka vitu mingi ah, kesho tena unasikia anataka scout so sasa hii tuko katika hiyo age jaribu kila kitu cuz yeah, you just exactly. never know try it eh hiyo hey, ukiona sasa kuna ile itakuambia hii ameshika like for example i've, I've noticed is he's, he's he's very good in in artwork ku kata makaratasi ku tengenza yeah, craft mapana. in craft work let me call it that way he's very interested home hiyo ndio vita tunapiga nanga ya makaratasi sasa hizi nani ameweka then he makes a kite he makes something oh, mm. a handyman mm. mwenzake akakuja how is he feeling eh he is feeling uh, amemkaribisha ama antagonism ni very mature and i feel he's very mature so kitu nili realize ni italeta hiyo so kitu nilifanya ni kupandisha huyu nini class moja mwambie sasa wewe ndio mkubwa wa huyu sasa wewe unajua umekuwa huyu akichangia umekuwa mtu mkubwa ukiona mtoto mimi ha yeye hii yeye anaingia eh anaingia ah ha, hakunywagi hiyo mami usimpatia <laughs> <laughs> na amekuwa mzazi kualiko yeah. yeye anamejua mm. anataka nini eh, so, mm. so 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 he, he he took that in the positive at first ilikuwa shida jua na shindwa hii ile attention yote so what i had to do ni kuchange attention sasa kwake juu huyu mtoto haelewi attention huyu wa kubebwa huyu ndiye anaelewa attention so attention yote ah tugi mpigieni makofi wacha uone akichukua hiyo daipa ya mtoto wacha uone akipeleka pale so he's like anapeleka <laughs> majestic. majestic majestic eh hey, jonaona eh hey, all makofi. eyes on me eh hey, so haijakuwa shida sana okay um uh, but i, 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 I anaona ni mtoto sana mm, anabeba bebo of course mm, anajaribu huyu hata hajui kusoma mimi <laughs> najua kusoma so i think it's a, it's a, it's a whole new experience for him but for us i think it's a, it's a, it's a beautiful kind of you've been there before mm. now the new baby what you did with tugi at mm. least you know mm. what not to do mm. and because what to do and what actually to do. most is what to do what to do eh kuna kuna vitu nyingi tulifanya unajua first baby unanunuanga vitu to me tulinunua roka ile inaitwa roka alirok nayo tu hawa sakalia kutoka hiyo siko tujai to me ile ya mm ata ile na inaimba tukaambia mpaka iko na bluetooth guy you have an igrikwa na bluetooth ilikuwa sijui na taz na waka size nyingi ndio sasa less than 2 hours akalia hajawahi rudi hapo tena so huyu mwingine pole sana kaenda sana kuna kitu kama hiyo lala kumbe mtoto wa kishiba ana lala so kumbe si wa kurokiwa ndora ni kushiba when you guys went to australia you were there for how long we were there for a week i think we went there on, from monday hey, for a week very funny yeah for a week yeah baby baby si ako home ako home na auntie yake one year ako home ametulia si mtu akuliandia hapana akishashiba mtoto na kuambia mtoto akishashiba analala as long as si mgonjwa hmm. akishiba na falale alafu sasa kuna ile mmemzoesha eh, kama ni sleep training yeah. kuna mahali wa analala Ah. analalanga peke yake he's been independent kutoka kitabu ah, so yeye akishashiba alale weka hapo akiamka anapewa kama ni maziwa maji whatever atapewa anarudi analala kesho asubuhi anaamka i envy such parents mimi angalia hivi mimi lola is now turning six she's six actually mm. lola kama hajanalia hapa mm. hiyo nyumba ilaliki eh yeah, sisi tulinini sasa ilibidi nilijaribu huko <laughs> wapi ai 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 and then you got even ada was in the same space mm. ada now started seeing things mm. Ona ona makokroch ona makokroch aziko <laughs> sisi nalikuwa kitanda huko na makokroch but kitanda yetu nimewa makokroch <laughs> tugi anasema nimewa water aliona sijui nini kuna movie fulani hapo alikuwa anaona ya Nigeria nimewa water nimewa <laughs> water i'm like umewa water nini wala yeah, so kwa kitanda yako mm, yeah, so god has been uh, faithful uk yeah, uk when you went to uk the baby was still yeah, was not one young. sasa hapo ndio ilikuwa kilieleweka but like sasa five, six months eh but sasa tuliacha tume express so akiamka same thing akiamka anapewa so ni ile tu kumis mama yake 
Okay, but mm. Alizoya. UK, mm. you were there for how long? UK was less than six days, I think. If okay. I'm not wrong, yeah. Sour. Mm. Now let's come to TTNT. Mm. Before you just used to do content online, what on on da 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 da. Mm. Mm. A lot of satire mm. on your content. Mm. Then at some point, boom, you say TTNT. Mm. Guys are like, okay, wait a minute. Mm. What's happening here? Yeah. Will he be able to transfer mm. what he's doing on mm. video to stage? Who came up with that uh, idea? Now it's 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 a beautiful idea Now let me take you to how it started. Now okay. tumekuwa tukifanya online kutoka year 20 wherever 20 <coughs> let me say 2012. No 2013. So 2013 14 15 16 <coughs> so we we had a, a, a following. Okay. And this following has always been online. So as I going to suggest tunataka kukuona live. Sawa? Okay. So that's why uh, as we continue to talk about the juice ideal to kapis siezi point ni hapa ama ni pale but it's a collective. So as one say manjugush nataka manzi kuwa cheki live. Hey, sasa nafikiria manzi live. Ni nini hiyo? Ni event gani hiyo nitawai yenda tuonane na wase wangu wote. So we figured what do we do? Do we go and I don't know. Aya so tukiwa hapo mimi nikafikiria nikasema naweza taka ku perform on stage. Ah, vitu zinaanza kuwa line. So mimi sijaifanya stand up. And what I'm doing hata sidhani ni stand up. So nikaambia so nikaambia Beli, Beli akaniambia Buda fikiria tuichape. So tukafikiria na uh, Bela ka suggest um, uh, kama ni kuifanya tuichape saa hii. So I called Butita because I had to call someone mwenye ashaifanya stand up. Yeah. So nikapigia Butita nikamwambia bro niko na hii idea nataka kufanya performance wase wakaamua ni check live. Hey najua vile tunaweza isuka tupatane kesho i am like a butita iko serious like ni butita kwa very serious hey, i'm like uh, uh, i kuambio ushai bagei na una do i kuambio <laughs> wewe tulia akaniambia kaende sana so uh, we met and then we we were like twende tu mahali tupange hiki pindi so hatuko tunajua tainaitwa nini whatever it is so we met um uh, i think to limit karen so ni tuanze kupanga niaje hii kitu ni nini so tukasema si unaendaga ku mc eh unapiganga whatever eh waka vinye tutamleta stage eh so to make situation then we have our funny stories of of yeah. how we we to me to me to me grow how to lipatana so from that that's where we coined through thick and thin ttnt is through thick and thin yeah. it's through thick and thin of what we've been of life basically through thick and thin aiko kwa wewe na nini that also at a profile group uh, picha yetu ya group ya creatives iko hivyo through thick and thin so it's two way it's through thick and thin iko na maana ya juu na maana ya ndani it's literal and <laughs> eh, it's literal and big <laughs> that's a, okay. and, and that's how the name became ikakua yeah. and we had our first ttnt in 2020 2020 tulifanya onyesho pale garden city big sana we never expected that we expected 500 people but we ended up having 2800 people na hapo ilitushtua and it was so crazy because we were thinking that's the only show we are going to do ttnt actually ilikuwa haikuwa one ilikuwa tu ttnt yeah because it was only through the candy we are never going yangu ilikuwa reason ya kuleta watu pamoja then i was like 500 of them eh hey. then they come more than 2500 i'm like guys you're not serious they are like are we having ttnt2 so that's where two came from are we having ttnt2 i'm like wait you want it again so nyim nataka tu nini eh two so kuna watu hata hapo wana join happen they are like tunataka to come unfortunately uh, 2021 covid 2020 sasa covid kaingia fit so 2021 the only time to have uh, your show i think to record here somewhere somewhere baraza media lab yeah, yeah that was the ttnt2 yeah we did it at baraza media lab now at 16 so those people who had paid for 25 it time ya covid we are like hatutaki kuita wase wengi juu tukia advertise wase watalipa na hatuna hiyo space uh, president amesema space imefanywa a that i think of yeah. kwa room kama ile kwa that of the people wanafaa kuwa so tulituma email the first day watu 20 walilipa first day na ilikuwa limited so i think it was around 2500 watu 20 then the next day kukatangazwa there is no in person meetings to happen and that was it so what do we do turudisha do tuka refund pesa tukapigia tukambia unfortunately hiyo show haita happen and that's it a month later, I'm like, to kona content, to share na kina butita na abel. What do we do with this content? To shoot. Yo, uh, um, uh, that time, uh, Baraza Media Lab, they had a space and they still have that space where creatives welcome, unafanya vitu zako. Yeah. I'm like, situ shoot ya hapo. 
Siku set tu menje audience tunatoa wapi? Siku na wale watu 20 wapigia simu niaje? Sasa ile show bado ina happen ndio kumefunguliwa tena a third of the people ima pesa tukurudishia eh this time atu walipishe mtakam walai they came so we had those people who were there in in 2021 had paid but kurudishia do yao yani ni wase walikuwa like kaende sana hata kwa na covid kaende sana yeah. so that's what we did in 2021 2022 we had t23 bado vitu ziko imefunguka sana we were not sure tukaka na robi cinema Wrong. We sold out at a kabla siku and and by the the same happened to T21 we sold out T22 season sema we sold out because we got 20 yeah. <laughs> ilikuwa we sold selected. out the 20 tickets yeah yeah <laughs> so T21 uh, two na three sold out so T24 which was now this year had to be big ha, yeah, we, we had to go back to nani ana kohoa au ni kahawa na jeu ndio and ko yangu alikuwa anaamka akiamka asubuhi <laughs> Muna mka hata nyinyi najua mko na mango kama mnamka nyinyi wote nao. Asikia <laughs> niko hoja sasa. <laughs> you have to go back the drawing board. Yeah, so I'm like uh, this year we were like with the team this year lazima iki to each other. So what do we do we advertise the show and that's what we did. We advertise the show. Punda si punda we advertise KCC. UK simu ikakuja. No, actually what happened is eh, kuna demand inaitwa Liz anko yangu <laughs> kuna demand aitwa Liz Liz she's the CEO pale Liz investment akapiga simu akasema orada tukiongea juu uh, tunauzaga mashamba na tukiongea akasema juu tulikuwa idea yetu ilikuwa ya this year tuzunguke nayo the country akasema amefikiria kwenda nje Mshaya na mtu ni kama hafikiri <laughs> so like yeah, tumefikiria kwenda nje <laughs> tumefikiria sana akasema ah niko serious let's start with UK kabla mfanye TNT ya KCC Let's start with UK. I'm like, "Oko serious?" Eh, hey, Liz, uko ni wapi umetuweka? Natumbia, "Eh, hey, I'll sponsor." Tuko na sponsor. Ni nini ngine tunangoja? Ticket na tuo na tuo. Twende hata tukipata watu 20 tuko sawa. Manze akaenda akapanga, akapanga kuna boys za huko anafanya promotion na inaitwa Kilunda, boys mpoa sana. Wakapanga na eh. So alienda kama December wakaongea, then kurudi sasa, em um, sasa akatuambia tumeshapanga, so tuanze ku advertise. Hey. I'm like guys. Yeah, you sure, are you sure? Yeah, and it happened. Butterflies. May 6th ndio show ya, ya Swindon ile happened sita is how. So tukapanda ndege, tuko na Liz wetu, pale Liz Investment, kasema na mimi naenda kuuza mashamba twende wote. Tukaenda. Manzi kafika nikacheki venue, nikasema Mungu wangu. Hizi <laughs> viti zote, unajua hata mtu unaleta viti nusu, eh, watu wakikuja zinaongezwa, tunaambia songeni songeni. Sasa ni unashinda upige ile picha ya before the calm the before the storm. Unajua ile picha huwa tunashtua nayo. Na ukipiga hiyo kukosa kuwa na storm. Ukwenda kuwa na storm but the calm. Eh the calm. Before the calm. Eh. Yeah. Anko yangu tena. So um <laughs> So the day of the show sisi tukaomba tuka show up. Wacha nikwambie mimi sijai piga show hivyo juu tulienda kwa nimeingia stage. So mimi niko kwa gari tulikuwa kwa kwa, kwa range rover nyingine moto sana sport tamu moto mpya gari unafanya mambo haiushikashiki gari hmm. gari nafungua kama mi, mi, milango ni na kegore mimi sijaishi maisha mzuri kama hiyo unatoka manchester unaenda kwa range, range rover na hakuna bamba kuna pothole na god eh si god sasa hiyo range rover imenifikisha kwa mlango vwap so mimi naambiwa ni kam mimi nadhani tunaenda backstage kumbe uk watu wanaeka time hata tumechelewa na 10 minutes nilienda kama nimeingia stage buda ile space haikuwa na wase chrome na sikia mchoma zinanuka huko sijui nini zinanuka huko i think tulifikisha a shy of 500 hiyo venue ilikuwa na fuck na 400 packs so mimi nikienda uk mimi nilikuwa najua mimi nataka tu watu 20 watu 20 nitapiga picha yangu hivi niko sawa <laughs> unanipata watu wa chrome manzi i'm like mpaka wana jam Applause. look for a bigger venue <laughs> hey. what's wrong with you manzi guys unajua walikuwa wametoka wapi kuna mrembo walikuwa wametoka northern ireland and that this najua tutamalizia na hiyo but this is what makes me believe in what i do it's a lot of nonsense what we do i wouldn't call myself a uh, the future who is the greatest the future Eddie Murphy no not a dimafi the future dave chapel i wouldn't call myself that because what you are doing is something crazy 
hauwezi yelewa hii ujinga tuko nayo ndio hizi video tunafanya ndio hizi watu that's what people are paying kutoka northern ireland it's about 9 hours kutoka huko juu ukuje swindon amepana ndege akakuja ni kama ametoka malindi amekuja nairobi kuwatch show sababu njugush amekuja hakuji juu ya anything hakuji juu kuna stand up comedy nataka uelewe anakuja juu ya ujinga ya jugosh na wakavinye that's what they are coming to pay unanielewa na akarudi so those people they are like you guys you need to look for a bigger venue i'm like no this is not uk that for us tuliko tumemalizia mwaka hapo yani hata mwaka ingeishia hapo tuseme sasa hakuna kcc tuko sawa because that was beyond our expectations it was huge and they were ready to laugh eh, the audience was eh, they are like maze next time kujeni bigger venue alafu mkuje kwa manini different we were like sawa tukarudi 6 may 27th may ttnt kcc ha bro tumeskuma onyesho then tunasikia ghafla binvu kuna msanii anakuja same venue msanii mkubwa na ni msanii napenda sasa hata ngodi yangu ilikuwa nitamiss show yake in the streets get not manzi ni napenda rich spice manzi ni ilikuwa guy nitamiss hii show and they you never get so ko wo wo ni check in manzi ni kwa ponde ting manzi ni kwa cho ponde ting naona ah rich spice anakuja tarehe ngapi 27 nita hata hii show siko nimeangalia venue ah then <laughs> kicc my brother nikasema sasa hapa yani uk ilikuwa Kimi sawa tungefungia hapo eh mungewachana na but kitu ikaniambia <coughs> kama mtu alitoka Northern Ireland akakuja kuoja akaacha vitu nyingi sana sasa rongai mtu atashindwa hapa na wako hapa umoja ndio <laughs> hilo wapi eh. ah mimi ngori yangu ilikuwa logistics tu vile uko kutapangwa parking itakuwa hiyo tu ndio ilikuwa ngori yangu lakini story na what because if there's something beautiful that has happened with the digital space you have your own people obi nataka ana kuchukia aje uko na watu wako hata nikijaribu kukufungia milango ngapi uko na watu wako utakuwa ukisema unaenda live wako Yeah. Now there is nothing Anyone that can kuna na those people will support you to the end hata ukiambiwa umeiba pesa ya serikali na ni ukweli obina umeiba pesa ya serikali they don't care they will say wrong example eh, but <laughs> no nasema tu si si mtu anaona ni ukweli jo huko kwa serikali labda ndakuwa unaona ikigekuwa jalas but that's not the point <laughs> Bunora hii sasa eh na kuona sana toka huko kabisa sasa nimetoka acha that's what I what I down what I down toka huko sasa ni sema vivyo vyote vile uko na watu wako that's the beauty eh that's the beauty of digital and they like you for you they don't like you because they want you to be like someone fulani they like you for you so Yeah, TNT long story short manze kama mkachenjua paki muka nikaona mnasema entry eh, the other side the other side sasa kuna paki because huko kuna entry ya watu wa eh, so tukaambia tuka mpaka nikabidi tuende tufanye video tuambie sasa get hata miss juu na kuangalia Harambe side tukaambia na then tukapata makarao kumbe hiyo side ni vijila kuna makarao kuna makarao huko sija why yona makarao understanding hivyo so wakati mbao ni nyinyi mko na show hapa ah sasa vile mtafanya unaona hii barabara usiku hainaga magari nyingi so tutazipanga vizuri and that's what happened so wasi walikuwa na come so imagine mume pack mbele ya polisi how safe can it get vigilance house. vigilance it's a very they are vigilante office ya dp yeah. vigilance mejipanga by mstaa acha nikuambie karibu mpatiwe pesa yenu ya tax hapo mkitoka kila mtu <laughs> so it was amazing in so many ways but again we sold out bro that place was full packed manzi kuna msali toka baringo and that's why I tell you it's crazy what people will do. Jamali toka Baringo ali arrive leo na show ni kesho. Amekuja tu mimi nimekaa mkungoja show. Eh akakaa mpaka mimi nilikuwa nadhani ni crew. Ana record na ni tag. Eh I'm like eh hey, crew amechangamka. Oh, crew amechangamka. Manzi on the day of the show ndio najua huyu mse ni fan ametoka Baringo ndiye huyu. It's crazy. Then oh, eh, tuka sell out. Ku sell out manzi wasa kwa ghetto kasema aturudi home. Fanyeni hivi tafuteni viti. Manze yeah. hii kitu ni packs 3k. Tutasimama hoya tukubalisheni tuingie. Manze hata kama nikulipa VIP tutalipa VIP tusimame nyuma. It was so packed. So we are like you guys and the beauty is a good number a repeat guys. Ni wase wamekuja TNT 1, 2 na 3. So hiyo inakuambia kitu. Loyal fan base. Exactly. Inakuambia kitu. So for us hiyo ilikuwa success. 
Bro, it was because I saw it. I had another event. I remember I texted mm -hmm. you mm -hmm. later. Mm -hmm. I was like, hey, bro, good stuff. Mm -hmm. I had another event. I was just like, I don't know. Everything aligned, bro. bro. From, 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 from everything, from the space itself. Yes. KCC, Ikabadilishua. It was arranged. Savo Ballroom oh looked different. Goodness. Kuna watu walicheza pale stage. <laughs> Mini ringia ni kadhani ni mkutano ya waziri. Kuna mm. stage iliwekwa pale. The stage was beautiful. Okay. I saw it too. Stage pass, wanaito stage pass. Walisiti pale. They did a beautiful job. Manze unakanyaga hivi, unafeel uko mayolo. It's yani soft. I saw bro. No artist in Kenya, comedian has filled out space like that. Uh, one God. person. You only God. You see one person. Me Most of the time when we do such mm. shows, like mm. we've done there a couple of other mm. shows, but no panango tuko wengi. No panango tuko apo. Ile kuyote zui na 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 na. But ni mulukwa wena wakavinye. People have come to see. Mm. Bro, that was. But let me just ask you. Mm. Ni nani aliwa bali chazile manguo? Manguo? Then you live up okay, ICC. Street look. Ah, bro. Street look. Ah, ah. Aina bado. Kasa uti chini. Hizo nguliva kwa hii TTMT ya KICC. Ai bro. Apaka ukapiga ai bro. Ilikuwa street look. Sasa ilikuwa. Unaona hiyo? Unaona hiyo umeongea? Ningevaa kawaida haungeongea. Issue ilikuwa waongea. Lazima utokea wasembe. Wow 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 wow. That was the whole. Hiyo kuwa hiyo. Eh na bado sasa TTMT 5. Hai nataka kukuja bila nguo. You know I bought that episode. I was watching it. Na angalia alafu kafiku ukatoa kale kabra. Kabra. Hati ye, niko na kijukusha mevaa nini. Iyo, iyo sasa, anaitwa Jael. Sasa tunataka kuwashitua because tumerealize, ukituzoea pia sana, ukizoea mtu, like ane meza ukuona na suti, like ukiona na nini. Ukiwa pigia binit. So weta na joto, iyo siyo street look. Polite. The theme, we go with themes. Now the theme was very categorical, street look. Sasa iyo ingine tutapiga, maybe kacho, ni kuja na alesa ya masai. Sindiyo hiyo, apana we banda, we ujui quality Hile ilikuwa nini Opa pia na nadi We unalalaga siya pia na nadi Hile ilikuwa pia na nadi buwana We unongia juu ya gani Siye ya green, siye ni green ama inaiko na tupache Siye ya pia na nadi Apia na nadi inakuwa imeshikana, hiyo ilikuwa suti I think ningekuja na antavata na kesho Ilikuwa shati, shati kando, troza kando Ayy Nokiatu ilikuwa sawa I've not spoken about the shoe Mimi shida ilikuwa hapa Inaitua bini, hii si hapa ni bini Nona sasa wewe Aya Sasa unasikia, ilikuwa kitu kuja tesa Toka Sold out and everything Mi sijayo na kitu kia line hivo Manzua sawa kakam, tukamaliza in good time Kabala makelele yanze, makelele kanza kidogo Hiku tu affect, we record because hiyo tundi ilikuwa Ngori yangu, manzi everything ilienda hakukuwa na any case juu sasa watu wakifika hizo numbers unasikia kuna case ilikuwa yes. sijui kuna msi aliumia kuna msi alifanya nini nada hakuna everything is aligning security ilikuwa fit stars are aligning mimi kabla kuna usiku siku wa ilala ni hiyo before or after the show i'm trying after show oh cuz i'm trying to digest whatever happened sipati picha one those are 3000 people who came Paid. They paid, sasa wacha kupay, waka facilitate kufika, walifika hapo waje transport, walikula. For someone to atoe doe yake ya kamevo, na si mara ya kwanza, but they came, man, for me, usha ijaribu kudigest kitu, then you go back again, back to zero. You're trying to think, what ni nini hii, like it was so huge, tulikuwa tunalala five asubui. Then unaingia tu kwa mtandao. I'm like, kuna shot hata huko umeona. I'm like no. Yani it was so crazy. Sidhani nitawai. Sidhani hiyo kitu itaini toka. Then tumemaliza hapo. Australia came calling. So someone so called you guys from Australia. Yeah, so tulikuwa tunafaa tumalizie eh tulikuwa tunafaa tumalizie onyesho hapo tuanze kuunza links pale njugushi.ke yeah. after cases because that's what usually happen. So kumaliza tukapata simu kutoka Australia. Eh kuna promoter pale eh Bazu anaitwa Peter wa Iron Lion eh, eh wa eh? Lion Wear eh? Iron Lion Wear Pita Pita akapiga simu akasamaniaje mnaweza kama show Australia <laughs> same thing as the UK you like hey? <laughs> what do you mean tulijaribu na UK lakini we <laughs> hey, atrage kujaribu ya pili uh. akasema no no kamini akasema sijai fanya comedy but nimefanya muziki amefanya wasanii wa big sana akina Cecilia akina nani 
nataka tujaribu comment eh manzi tiki tiki visa ikatoka within two days hata <coughs> uk sijui litoka the same manzi god yani vitu zikia line hivi ikatoka manzi tuanze ku hype iko when eh hiyo july tulienda bro tulikuwa tunachapa show nne back to back different states so mnatoka hii state it's like a one hour two three four five hours away so tulikuwa tumaliza hiyo nyesho so ya kwanza ilikuwa adelaide my goodness adelaide tukatoka adelaide tukaenda um, path path melbourne so after every show show tulikuwa tunachapa kama saa mbili ya huko so inaisha kitu saa tano saa sita saa sita ameanza kujipanga ju saa tisa mko na flight ya the next day mtaenda kulala mbele so mkifika huko mnalala asubuhi saa nane mmeenda eh, sound test then jioni saa mbili same thing then usiku same thing, same thing. until zikaisha man jeshi australia mimi sijawahi jua wasi bro ulifikiria huko tu mkubwa hapa ruiru <laughs> So na ni ujinga tu. Eh. So manzee wase wame come. I'm like you guys you are not serious. Tukamaliza. So tukimaliza ghafla bin vu. Sasa tunarudi. Si tunarudi kisho imeisha. <laughs> Sasa. Boja, wacha, wacha, wacha. <laughs> zuia, zuia, zuia. <laughs> wacha mimi niuze magari. <laughs> Before mambo ichemuke huko. Listen, uh, if you've been watching or been a show live, you know that I always talk about Magari affordable. If you want a car, unataka kutafuta machine moja polite, upgrade, wacha kutembea na kadudu, ama you just want your kadudu ya kufanya biashara, unataka ka Probox, ama a very nice machine, talk to Magari affordable, they'll be able to hook you up with a moti of your choice, flexible payment plans. Kuna wale wanataka anga waletewe import, kuna wale wanataka locally uh, used cars, they can do that for you as well, okay? Talk to Magari Affordable or Kopaliko in social media. The number is on the screen now. Call them up. And then you get to meet up with them. They'll uh, be able to upgrade you to a better ride. Na ukisha maliza hivo, unapiga luku moja safi. Unaingia Royal Feet Style Hub. Their contacts are also on the screen now. Just call them up. They're in Westlands. Uh, Karuna Close Bavaria Garden Shop number one. Ndiyo watu wanapigisha watu luku. Unataka sneakers. Unataka majacket. Unataka maluku noma noma. Unaingia ndani. All right? Most people in the army talk they oh bina now sasa pesa nitatoa wapi unaona venye kuko that's why i'm telling you go to www.motobet.com that is m o t b e t it's on the screen right now .com play their crash game ni kanini kana panda unaweka kama ni 10 bob kana panda kakienda times 2 kana kwa 20 bob the trick is to withdraw before it crash so ingia motobet some quick money unachangamka na kale ka 10 ka 20 kwa kwa simu before you know na omoka na ukiomoka na nita unanishikia kamoja wacha turudi kwa muhahe mm. watu wamepiga show mm. the shows in 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 australia oh, full house mm. they were full house yeah 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 full house imeja proper Imeja how many proper. people are in each of them approximately um, approximately i think we did around uh, around 3k in in lump sum yeah total in total yeah i think we did hapa uh, kuna 500 hapa 600 hapa uh, 4 ivo ivo like exactly that. but yeah. in total i think we did ju sasa ukiangalia kwa ticketing yeah. so apo that's why you can tell because it was on on event bright i think yeah yeah 3 3k plus na manamba ju okay mm. when you guys finish the show did you have time to travel around to see the no, place no 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 unamaliza tulimaliza si ndio na kushow unamaliza hivyo hivyo no after the the last show after the last show siku kama wekanga siku mbili after the last show ya kuona around hey, tunarudi sasa kuuza links bwana yenyewe basi shida mtoto unajua sasa shida pia tumeacha mtoto so hawezi so there's no even time ya let's see australia bro let's, let's see na walk on the street ai hakuna unamaliza kama umezonga so you guys didn't have no time hata mm-hmm. kupiga picha pale kwa zile tu gorofa tumenanga shua pale uh-huh. Sydney ah uh-huh. ah wewe uliona picha sijaona bro hey, ni tumalize show kama tumesonga after Sydney flight the same way nimekwambia flight saa tisa turudi Melbourne Melbourne eh, flight yetu sasa ya sasa kurudi kurudi home so eh, ilikuwa tight We? ilikuwa tight ilikuwa no free time eh. mm. ilikuwa yeah. tight yeah. ilikuwa kazi yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but it was so na, na, 14 thing. hours again mm. from nini to Qatar Yeah so 14 hours then um, another 4 hours 
layover but hizo zilienda haraka juu tulipata twitter imewaka moto then now four hours sasa za kurudi hivi za kurudi nini liwakija twitter moto so um ni mungu okay so um if there's something beautiful that happens is what happened then so all this is happening hii moto ya twitter it's happening to kiwa uko more than 30 feet above 30000 feet uko juu so mimi sijui nini naendelea Ume chill. Na so mbebe. Ume chill mina land Qatar. Qatar show zimeuliwa, tuko sawa, tumetulia, then na land Qatar. Mse wa kwanza ananiambia, msemo sielewi. Unacheki zile jokes za ah, na, tunasikia baridi. Oh. I'm like mtu anakuambia hivyo Qatar. Eh, Stranger. Unasikia baridi. Ah, I'm Kenya. Unajua ah. sasa Qatar ni base yetu. Qatar eh, wa Kenya wamejaa. Wa Kenya wako wengi sana. Eh. So tuna land hivi msema ananiambia hivyo, sielewi. Mse wa pili sasa ndiye anatuambia nini naendelea tuna tuna login wifi ya, ya airport ah! ndio naona kumbe sasa hata watu ndio wanaongea sasa wacha mwenye maneno watu ndio wanaongea so tulipata hii story imepoa so tunapata ala so kulisemekana hivi eh. na watu wakasema hivi okay mine is not a question mine is just a comment the food was nice sasa <laughs> 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 nikuongea so hiyo four hours ilikuwa ya eh okay ku digest then tena tukaingia kwa flight another four hours sasa tukaland tukaland Kenya sasa kuland Kenya manzi sasa nafungulia napata ma blogger wako hapo eh At, actually hata kabla ma blogger mm. napata ma client wananiuliza wewe unapatia ngaje yako nini i'm like ah, kwa hivyo nisituka nane ah sawa <laughs> pause pause ulikuwa umesema i'm coming hapana nilikuwa tunataka kusema maoni kidogo unajua mtu unakuaga na maoni <laughs> <laughs> kama mwanaume unagwaga na maoni alafu sasa nikapata pia kuna apology but bottom line is eh? uh, maybe what 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 i gathered from all this one what i told you um we, we are living in a very beautiful time in terms of digital whatever there are some things people are doing and not understanding them but they are working they might not pass any and, and you see like e digital to me break every rule kama inge kwa tv tungesha kata ungesha ni kata kitambo ungesha niambia eh hey, sasa juu ya time tungemalizia huko tulikuwa tunaongelea sijui nini yeah. kiatu hiyo inge ishe huko ingi na tungefanyia sasa ya mtandao yako you get yeah. but now we can be able to break rules kama sasa hii hapa kuna kitu inaendelea na ni different from from, from We're this side water, yeah. nini. so it's it's very unique times where you do your own thing doesn't matter how rough it is how rough edge it is where ifanye uko na jeshi yako and that's it it's, it's exactly what happened with set top boxes when we had free to air saa hii mimi naweza nishisha tv yangu na sisi muda mtu wa shakahora alikuwa na tv yake alikuwa na onwa mpaka watu wanatoka kwenye wanatoka wana wanaenda so it might not be so straight it might not be very very smooth but this is what we are doing and people are paying people are supporting corporates are coming on board so if there's something that really came out of that day is one if you have your numbers uko sawa you cannot have all numbers then you cannot want me to be because the, the argument was i am not good at stand up yet mwenye anasema hivyo haja watch hata moja na hiyo ndio kitu ilikuwa nataka nifanye niongee kidogo because hajaingia pale kwa mtandao kwa website angalia it tnt what is it about because it's not really a stand up yeah ni basically ni njugush live na haezi keti that's why ni me stand up Sio kama unanipata. Siwezi ingia ni unanipata. So joke zangu napiga kama nimesima. Nimesimama. And I don't want to be Dave Chappelle. Sio kama unanipata. Can only be one Dave Chappelle. Hapana, acha kusema hiyo ate ya, ya kinini. Sitaki kuwa huko Dave Chappelle. I don't okay. want hata tukikuwa tu sitaki kuwa Dave Chappelle. And there is a reason why I'm saying this. Is because what we are doing is so ni, sasa Samido ataenda huko sema yaimbi kama ya Disharon. Si anaenda anaimba mugidhi yake na haimbi na vile mezoea but wasao talipa top dollar kuona samido corporate atakelea do and they use whatever anauza huko why is because it's for that crowd is for a particular nika cocktail umetengenezea tu particular crowd so another point na hii si atendi nini if you want me to be Dave Chappelle BJC or or TD Jakes hawezi sema pasta wetu anahubiri sijui aje akue TD Jakes unaelewa because it's our own wacha kumeza hiyo kitu hivyo you know what we are watering it down aa <laughs> nasema nasema I, I get it hey. you are shooting you are talking while defending no nasema we are talking about bullets no, hapo no skia nasema it's like to rudi uko because <laughs> tena anyway nikirudi uko aji atachemuka <laughs> but nasema 
if, if like you can we are very good at sofa set wewe huyo si akue bro amka kwa hiyo kid unanielewa my point is we are doing what we can be able to do and if i can be able to bring together a few people wakam ni waambie nonsense because it's a lot of nonsense naambia na wanafurahia a lot of nonsense and they have paid for the fourth time na bado kuna dema litoka na sisi adelaide akaenda path akaenda melbourne na hizo zote analipa almost 5 g's per ticket analipa hizo zote then ananunua ticket na ananunulia wase wengine kama mbao ticket back home hiyo nakwambia nini ni ni kuwe kama de chapel Unani arawa? Nakupata. Katika ujinga wangu <laughs> hapo ndio werevu wangu unapika. Sijui kama tunaelewana. Ujinga wangu katika ujinga wangu hapo ndio werevu. Look at the the things we've been able to do in terms of digital. Look at the people, look at the young kids who are earning today in digital. Mimi naangalia gajeshi kama ya kina Austin Mungai, akina I am Kabugi. Hawa si angalia online uh, whatever zao. They are eating good. They are not following anyone's gatekeeping. Atelazma ufanye hivi. They are doing a lot of nonsense in their own wisdom. But the boys, the girls, they are making money. And that's my point. If we found Jews to metagemea serikali for a very long time, nothing is forthcoming. We have found a way of doing like for example what I, basically what I'm saying is hiyo show nilijipangia. Si show nilisikia kuna show inafanywa nikaambiwa come you headline ama utakuwa part of in show you you know what takes to kuwa na show nikambia waseni aje kamini kujeni na wakakamu na wakalipa so ngori iko wapi ngori iko wapi you get my point i got you eh hey, it's it's and, and i think this is where you should be going instead of ni poa corporate wako na wanatushikilia because even in this live event we are doing but for a change instead of kuongojea wakuite si waite uambie ni aje mimi ni fulani fulani nafanya ga ujinga fulani na wasi wanapenda kama ebu let me ask you mtu kama abermotua kidi anafanyanga unataka kuniambia ni kitu kukaa chini upigie watu sorry wakurugenzi kupiga <laughs> unanielewa ni kitu hauwezi elewa anakupigia story unaka ni story ungesikiza kuka yako akipiga but utalipa top they dollar they pay and sit down and wana kama wana uh, why yeah. it's because he's talking to them now this digital is not for talking to everyone talk to unaongelesha watu wako unaweka kando you, we have pockets there are some people who follow you they don't follow me and they don't think i'm worthy to be followed you get na siezi sema ati hey manzi mimi si mkali ju and, and vice versa wezi sema ati ju mse wangu hakufind siju kiwa siju kana ni reverse taki tushinde hapo but my point is, is there something i've learned is manzi god ukutupia ukutupia because wacha nikwambie if there is a time we sold links for you, TTNT that time that time totally so far said talk tukianza deal houses hii mnasemanga hapa hii ni kali tu anko anko yango na mali so yeah. we we when we started real houses hey watu walikuwa na maneno big wig flani pale twitter akawekelea akasema in show ya mambochi nani ataona na wanataka kuenda ati oscars sasa hiyo lupita alikuwa ameshinda oscars the 12 years a slave manzio kitu ni to depress ju ndio tumeanza and mark people will always come just when you're starting sasa hiyo ni nini obina amena when you're starting so manzi tumeanza real house tumse akuja ati ah nataka kuwa masijui wanafanya show wanaona ile quality oscars the same thing about quality and what we are doing because we are doing for a very kenyans are very unique uh, people audience very unique kitu ina wafurahisha ni fani sana ingia mtandao zetu taona mzee wanashindana kula ugali now eh Eh, I don't get so, bad you kula kula show. So, <laughs> <laughs> na imagine wase no. you get. Yeah. Peleka hiyo Boston. Tashutiwa. Now, eh, nilikuwa nasema nini? Twitter, nasema big wig aliongea. Yeah, Akasema, "What? Na hiyo kitu nitaiframe, ni reframe ya Rupita but ya usi kuframe." Yake alisema, 
hawa watu wote wanataka kuenda Oscars with the quality juu kuliko nafanya ya households guess what one week later nani ana tweet lupita Lupita. to the nyong anasema god mtakutafutia hiyo screenshot god bless njugush that's where bless njugush litoka nilikuwa najiita fani njugush so god bless njugush i wish everyone understood swahili having the time of my life that's what lupita nyong said no she put on a tweet and in her facebook i screenshot that was validation one oh kwa api ule alikuwa anasema hatutafika Oscar you get <laughs> na hapo ndio tulikuwa naanza kama kuna kitu ilitupatia moto ni hiyo and mark you real house has been one of the best um, uh, 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 sitcoms TV exactly yeah, in, yeah. in the country it made a couple of people from akina shiti exactly to... look angalia shiti sasa shiti angekuwa uh, yes. wapi kama tungesikiza hao watu wa by the that's what actually made shiti eh. because shiti was magazine mm. before he was doing stand up eh, comedy alafu kumbe alikuwa na kitu gani anachapa exactly look at the guy so my point is ziko na ni poa but i'll be mad if people don't talk i'd be i'll feel like i'm doing nothing if people don't talk by the way i'm so happy when people talk especially negative negative goes more than positive if someone says True. hey obida kona show kali sitaenda kwa yeah yeah ni obina sasa ni hizo sure ati anafanya ati hata hebu nione hiyo amesema ati anafanya vibaya then they come and note they're like have you ever looked at something you're like it's not as bad as people are saying wait na kuna zingine ah obina acha ujinga na hata interview you yeah. get some followers you didn't have there so I'd rather people talk negative yes that was one na kule hata hapo najua unataka kunikata eh pole sana no 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 then is obina show live then when i left tv yes People are like eh sasa ameacha TV si real house msimeshika ameacha TV eh sasa anaenda wapi ati anaenda kufanya vitu Facebook nikaambiwa mpaka nilikuwa group za wasanii kuna walikuwa wasanii fulani walikuwa na group walikuwa nasema audio wasanii na Nairobi Mungu halali ay ay sasa Mungu wangu aki halali Mungu wangu let it out bro it's like kunaweka sana waambie 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 mhm na ni vizuri unaambia watu so that next time they might do that to someone who is almost making it but akuyeye si mtu wa roho ngumu yeah, and give up. give up so when we are doing online wakasema ati nimeanza kuchoma soko ati nafanya online badala niende kwa tv na nafanya facebook ati nafanyia mama zao comedy <laughs> as we speak the same people na waonanga wakingangana online ndo wanaanza kujaribu eh hey, ati bro unaweza kwanza kuna moja bro unaweza fanyaje zishike unachikisana vile unapataga aje client Hmm. Unajua nilimkumbusha? Niambe bro unakumbuka nikikuwa unakumbuka? Ulisema? Eh hey, nilimshow juu ni mtu nitakwambia wewe acha tukate nitakwambia. <laughs> Sasa my point is yes. I've seen these things. They always happen. Only that this time is from a source I didn't expect to come from. But I've seen it happen. So my point is it's the same thing. So wewe kama kuna ujinga yako uko nayo bina tufanye ujinga. Yeah. Eh. Yeah. So mm. Kuna watu wanapenda njahe na mm. kuna mtu anachukia njahe. Eh hey, then art is very subjective. Yes. Wewe manze unaweza ushaiona watu wanaonanga F1 racing. I have such At friends. A couple position. What the? Kwa kwa ni una watch hizo. <laughs> si watch to Manchester Arsenal. Manchester igongwe. Una get? <laughs> We all have different liking. Kuna wengine wana watch kabadi. <laughs> Kabadi kichezo hawezi lala una get na kuna wengine wa cricket nilienda Australia nikapatana na Pakistan fulani manzi nikamza what do you know about Kenya kaniambia cricket unajua mchezaji mmoja wa cricket mi cricket ni exactly. mjana nyama it's very <laughs> it's very subjective na wewe sema ate juu wewe hauchingi a particular anyway wacha tu sidi kwa nini tuna derf hapo <laughs> let's what i down hey, miki le najua bro mungu anatupenda and uh, as long as you're doing something as long as you're putting it work putting in work people are singing kenyans are supporting local and i think that's what i'm all about let's support local and kenyans are supporting quality local yeah mm. we si ume si umesema <laughs> this is what i always tell most kama kuna mtu nimeuma i'm not reacting. sorry <laughs> sorry i'm not mm. sorry what happens is this no, what, whatever you do people always talk mm. whatever you do bro mm. ukitembea pole pole ona huyu mm. ukitembea raka haya ukivaa mm. vizuri ona mm. tuinje ukivaa mm. baa ana nguo and another thing sorry ya mwisho hii ni ya mwisho <laughs> juu umesema juu ya nguo <laughs> eh uh, it's not that i don't we, we don't um, take criticism but a cow cannot take criticism from a dog huh? an elephant cannot take criticism from a fish This is the point. Ha, 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 yeah, ha, ha. I take criticism 
from a fellow fish not from a fellow fish from a fellow elephant i am mimi niko kwa kwa hiyo ocean tuko na mafish ndio naniambia like for example from t21 there's a lot of things we've changed like for example people say we want eh wakavinye more on stage aoni wase walisema So we've been gradually adding this is just an example we've been gradually adding her time on stage. So I listen to such criticism they're like anjugushi ya ukufanya fit fanya hivi you take that criticism. Yeah. But sio mtu akukuja kuambia hii na wak waacha. Tunataka hili wakiawa na hii kwa hapa Kenya nje uifanye. Wewe si uende kwanza hii wakia nje alafu kuja. What is the highest amount that you've ever gotten from a client corporate? with the nonsense that you do hiyo umesema yako kaujinga unakafanya ni pesa gani ulipatanga ukasema he haka ka nonsense yenyewe kanalipa eh unataka sasa no ballpark figure just approximation digital ama yeah, on digital, digital space yeah that's what you've been doing since because you have someone who's starting digital now probably ako na 1000 subscribers even 200 subscribers and make it to work kweli i think how i put it it's per per unit unajua unaweza patiwa 10 million yeah but reporting kwa ke daily for the next 10 years okay but kuna mtu atakupatia meter for a video okay so one, let's bring it a video so one mic mimi nikashindwa ai unataka nini ndio hiyo one name fanya video wewe ushaiona unajaribiwa i'm like and god ni mso hiyo video ilienda fit anyway wacha nisiongee tuendelee okay. uh-huh. one name for a video mm. Okay. God ni mso. God is working so. working somehow. Na ndio nakwambia na hiyo ni ujinga. Na kama ningeambiwa ni kwa mwelevu. <laughs> so people Unaka know you. Unaka <laughs> Tukue wajinga. <laughs> people know you a lot for satire. Mm. You've been uh, with the Uhuru government you were throwing a lot of jabs. Mm. Then when the Ruto government also came you also still there doing mm. the thing, throwing mm. a lot of jabs. Mm. Then at some point ukajipata state house. Mm. Nikapa niliitwa. You know there's a difference eh? Huh? Kuna watu wanajipeleka? <laughs> <laughs> na kuna watu wanaitwa now this was drama festival i'm very big about uh, local because for me if this something is going to make us money as young guys content creation is one of those things that you don't re- uh, rely on someone you don't rely on tunaongoja nani approve it's yeah. you and your camera ufanya ujinga very we ndo approve <laughs> uh, eh upate jeshi yako now kuliko na drama festival so tukaitwa and we talk about the your time kuliko na the 15% Eh, taxation tax, for eh, tax, digital. Eh, digital content creators at at tukatue b- b- withholding a 15% that's why I went because liambiwa amekuwa kifidiwa different whatever now he want to hear it from the horses mouth the only way we can be able to make decision if, is if we are on the table okay. gori tunafanyaga ni tunakaa na huku tulituma msia tuwakilishe hatu follow up kumbe na yako story zake huko yeah. but until that day we will be on the table that's the time So yeah so this is what kwa tent nikajipata kwa tent ili kwa tent tent si tent kabla tuende kwa tent no there was a meeting for real yeah, so you sat with the president one week ago hiyo ilikuwa what would we call it hiyo ilikuwa formality event. later there was an event that was an event but before that you guys had a one on one with the president yeah, what so did you discuss about 15% it's not fair to pay 15% where everyone is paid 5% sasa hii hata kama finance bill ime suspendiwa ili ilibaki 5% it's finance act still not passed yet Ah, iko si iko kwa nini? Yeah, so in passes to be a bill. Kwa, kwa at the court, moment it's eh. still an act. Ah, ah iko kwa court. It's an it's act. Fine. It's fine. It's Let, an we, act. We They are acting. <laughs> no, they are acting. I a rudi hapa, rudi hapa. Kama haijakuwa nini? Kwa nini mafuta imeongezwa nini? <laughs> rudi hiyo iko kwa kwa finance bill. That Ah, wewe bana, hapana bana. Listen, for mafuta kupanda, hiki tu imeenda, imeenda. Ili sainiwa nani Ruto alisainini asubuhi? Aya, si we go back. Tugugu, Ruto alisainini asubuhi. Ndio nawaambia hiki tumpende. The only tactics ndo tusijue alienda state house kufanya nini. Ah, si ndio hiyo nimesema. Nilipitishwa. Ah, si nimesema. But the time you guys were still discussing it was a finance act. Eh, hiyo hiyo time nadhani unasema sasa hii. No, it was an act then. Eh, sasa ndio nasema then ilikuwa akina nani the the chairman Kimani walikuwa wana tick maoni from guys. And that's the time eh, ya, ya kuweka and ilikuirudishwa kwa bunge. Hiyo time tukiwa iko imepeleka kwa bunge. Yes. Hizo walienda so Klaus per Klaus which yeah. was very important that time. We go and we address that so that as we are going na tukaongea na KJ, mheshimiwa KJ, 
there is someone else tuliongea nae from the senate about what it means because there were different nini unajua wasanii wako na pesa unajua there was different whatever yeah. hatukatai like any other kenyan should be able to pay but if I'm a consultant like you umeenda mali una offer your services as a consultant you should not pay 15% na madaktari una lipa 5% yeah. and that was so then it was an act and that's why we were there to say sasa hii tunataka iteremshwe tuache huko orezo alikuwa anasema 8% but tukamwambia 8% bado iko high juu hata madaktari any other consultant wanalipa with holding ya 5% and that's why we left it then kemani the kina uh, kemani akapata na kina jeff kuri and there some other few content creator went now to the, uh, co- uh, the committee the parliament committee na wakapeleka so when hizo zote zilikuja that's when they came to 5% then it can pass so it is 5% then it can suspend you na koti sasa okay. saiko kwa mikono ya koti and that's why the nani anaitwa nani jogosh huyu wa cs alienda kwa koti kusema koti ina ina wa, nini waachilie hiyo finance bill because now the money walikuwa wanategemea kwa budget imeshikiliwa hivi juu hiyo doa alifanya ushaifanya budget ya nini nikilipwa <laughs> eh, nikilipwa nikilipwa <laughs> mtasikia eh, sasa wakilipwa imesimamishwa so that was the mm. reason why yeah, so that's you why went we were to exactly house. so that's why we went to, to, to state house because people saw it the people were like ah traitor hapana unajua sasa shida yetu shida yetu ni moja shida yetu ni um, now if if completely i didn't talk about it it would be another thing okay. oh akina njugusha waku ongea oh akina njugush so when i get a chance i'll always talk okay you get two i'm not elected i didn't go to people and tell them you please elect me you eh, me by the me hata hapo ninaweza sema nilikuwa nimeenda huko ndio mamangu na babangu wafurahia unajua vile walifurahia you get my point but my point is there some whatever took me there it was achieved it, it did, uh, okay. yeah so there was a one on one with the president yes. about the mm. so ni nyinyi mmetuokolea sijasema hivyo it was na that's why nimesema nimesema kemani nikasema kina Jeff Kuria walienda huko kemani huyu akasema hivi hao akasema hivi then tukaongea na uh, KJ KJ yeah. was on the forefront wa kusukuma hivyo the concerted effort it can make sense oh kumbe but if we keep quiet as content creators and we expect other people to be able to make those decisions there are some other more pressing matters mtapotrea ulichekia finance bill vile ilikuwa inakaa iko na vitu mob you are the last mi hata vile tulikuja kukua huko juu sijui ni nini content creators it it you had a lot of issue you look for the other guys who are busy how oh, and you how mm. nayo nayo mm. and then i don't know why people don't like content creators living a good life philip eh wako nayo waliwelimwe kwa like yo bro i've suffered enough i, I know but um, there's also there's a lot of things but nikiongea hapa itakuwa another one day but but, but uh, your uncle but 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 um uh, uh, there's no when a pastor lives a good life kosa anaenda manze mpaka na bodyguard ni mtumishi wa mungu eh anafanya kazi ya mungu when a politician anaishi fit eh manze politics iko na dongo like anasifiwa yes when both of those wakikuja chacho wanakaa pale mbele content creators nani alisema si ni maskini sasa hiyo ndio inaanza kuwa shida. Eh hizo do. Kweli unaweza kuwa na if it's true tumekuwa na hizi do na tulipi tax then the government has been failing. You get what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, but staki turudi huko juu watu wanasema mnajiona aje kwani nyinyi nani hamtaki kulipa tax. Sasa tusemi hivyo. Wewe sisi tunateta hivyo juu hii na tuhusu. Yes. Mm. Na pia tuka text tadu ya 16 VAT fuel. Anyway tukianza kuongea tutachoka. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Mm. Haya. <laughs> Haya, maswali mbili tatu za mwisho tukimalizia we've had uh, njugushi here for a minute. Naona kuna watu wamesoma hapo wanatuambia a bill is not an act of parliament. A bill becomes an act if it's approved by the parliament. Na wale wamesoma wako huku. But mnaelewa kile tunasema? Yeah, bora you get uh. the point. Unajua <laughs> sasa Sema, tumesoma sana. Are we talking to somebody? Good. We move. Haya, maswali mbili. Mm. Yeah. But ni poa mmetulonga ishole mmetu nini mmetu yeah, unatufunza but labda kuna mwingine pia anakuwa hapa amwambia wewe you ni sio hivyo ah iko iko sawa but yes. amelewa kile tulikuwa tunasema point is home point is home ili shasa iniwa ishasa iniwa sasa hata ukiagi kama ni act ama ni biliko ndani sasa ni nini imesibamisha yeah yeah ni I can't wait till TNT comes to America and Jugush supporters kila mahali are you going to America hiyo ni TNT5 sasa TNT5 tunataka sasa tuifanye vizuri bro sasa hizo watu wajitaachie kutweet. TTNT5 sasa American ndani. Mm. 
Wewe. Mungu atupatie uhai, Mungu akipenda. Oh. Okay. Mtu amesema wachana na F1 kabisa. Pomira <laughs> wana, ni watu wa Mercedes, wana gongo kila siku. <laughs> na wamevaa mat-shirt ziko na mavitu mingi. <laughs> na mnachekelea Arsenal wa rati wako na kit sijui na kaa nje. <laughs> Petronas. <laughs> Petronas watch F1. Well, this is they zunguka the same place a couple of times. Wii wii na tugali tudogo. Wani ni gari kubwa. Hapa <laughs> juu yashimiwa wanaenda na mavi 8. <laughs> Alafu <laughs> anakuja na kaumbwa kadogo. Sasa unajindo. <laughs> But how wao wana understand? They're like, "Eh, hey, umeona hey, ku pull position. Manzi, yes. kwa nini ame It's the same thing when you Una play five people love football. Yeah. Mzee mka like so my manager anapenda football. Game ikikuwa anakasirika na bako zile bro. It's just 11 men chasing the skin of a dead cow. The pass <laughs> bana pass. Ah, Ako... Nikola like, bro you do realize it's, it's a game. Mm. It's called like a game. Mtu wa table tennis hapo amechanganyikiwa sana. Unaona bila tuko different kabisa. Mm. Ah, yeah. watu wa America wanasema wanakungoja. Mm. Rebu uliza jugusha na vavi atukia tunamba. <laughs> <laughs> Mwambie uulize vitu ziko serious. Uliza. <laughs> Hapa tuko na shida. Vitu zimepanda bei na wewe unauliza kiatu ka shame on you. Ah. Anaitwa nani? Shame on you. <laughs> Sasa namba ya kiatu anaitwa Frank. Ona ni mwanaume. Mm. Mm. Si maybe anauzanga viatu. Eh. Ah. Kuna mtu an... oh, Maybe okay. hata anataka kunipatia kiatu wewe unataka kuharibu. Si wewe ndio umeongea mbaya. Wewe ndio unaharibu. Ati kwanza ni mwanaume. Kwani mwanaume hawai kuuliza namba ya kiatu? Kwani namba ya kiatu inasema wow, nini? Ni kiatu ni bokogoro. Wow. Ume nigeuka? <laughs> ni kama ni mimi. <laughs> mimi nimesema waulize maswali serious. Ni <laughs> <laughs> Frank amesema iko serious hata mm. kununulia kiatu. Mm. Mm. <laughs> be nice, be nice. Mm. Ule mse ana Oh, oh wanakupatia hongera na heko, mm. wanasema yeah. unafanya kazi poa mm. sana. Um, wanasema njugush na wadays ume gain body shape sana. Uliwacha umesharudi gym. Body shape. Eh, yeah, asema kuna shape. Kwa nini mnaongea madharau hivyo? <laughs> no. Okay. I saw you at the gym. I remember there's a time I told you bro good stuff. Yeah, I need to people... come to your gym. Yeah. Then at some point you told me umekuwa too busy. Yeah. You mara umeacha. Yeah. Are you back to the gym? Yes, yes. Nimekuona yeah. lakini sasa unaelewa mambo ya mtoto. Ah unaamka saa tisa bro niko na wainne unaamka ni wakubwa nasema mko hata wakiwa dogo bro you have time for what matters hakuna mata si australia wewe ibu imagine unaamka si unaenda australia kerelia kerelia unaamka unaamka hivi mm. ukienda tu ku step out kwa ngee sasa utaenda gym. gym unarudi sasa gym ni mtoto tu eh yeah, unarudi but but uh, yeah yeah unasikia mimi nasema nimegina them ladies <laughs> I belong to the street. Street of Roydo. in conclusion, mm. uh, what's your take on what's happening in the country currently? Where? That's my take. <laughs> <laughs> you, because it's a rot. Tukianza kuongea hapa tutambua hiyo bill ni act. Sasa Some to act. Yeah, but but yeah. I think um one I I, I keep saying ukipanda mahindi Okay. Utalimia. Ukipanda mahindi, utalimia. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Ulikuwa na expect kitu deep. <laughs> ukipanda mahindi, utavuna uta, uta mahindi. Eh, yeah, sidio, wewe jangao ukipanda mahindi utalimia. What do you mean? Eh, yeah, so it, it's good. Watu walijionea. Hiyo finance bid ilipelekwa huko. Ilipelekwa kwa parliament. Kona watu tulipigia kura vile walipiga kura. Tuliona si ati sini wajinga tuliona. So whatever tulipanda tunaiona. So I think I don't know mimi sijui shida yetu ni nini ikifika uchaguzi. Huwa ni kama tunapinduliwa kichwa chini miguu juu. Sijui kama nielewa. Tunaanza kupiga kura but bottom line is I think uh, tuangalie ile jeshi tulichagua. Eh, because bottom line tuna get what we deserve hakuna mtu alituletea watu whether be it mca whether be it your mp whether be it your ni sisi tulijichagulia okay yeah, so my my nini ni we mungu hmm. atusaidie thank you so much for coming we we appreciate <laughs> we good stuff you're doing thank you endelea so. zidi na uzidi na uzidi asante na hiyo kuku ilikuwa tamu oh kuku ya miale mm. yes it's called miale special ah
Ah. Very nice. Nice. Ni mekula mpaka ni kama itamea kwa tumbo. Yes. So thank you so much for creating time. Thank mm. you so much for coming. We mm. really appreciate. Mm. And everybody who is watching on live on TikTok on YouTube as well as Anteni sana. Mm. Next week we're going to be having two individuals who are uh, good friends of mine. We're going to be having Robert Burale and also we're going to be having Chipukizi because Chipukizi has been the game for about 10 years. He's doing a show called Ten Toes Down. Ah, nice. So on 5th, I think he's doing the show on 5th in Zintika. Mm. So we're going to have him next week as well. We mm. to pick a story. Ilianzaje ikakuaje? Itakuaje? You know akaenda apa aje ndani ya government. Now government inatupangia aje. Then Burale pia kuja from be your loving uh, coach and friend uh, Burale. Mm. A marriage <laughs> is a scam. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean, whatever you will say. So I will have that one next week as well. And if there's any other guests that you also want us to have, we'll be having them. Also, we have booked OG. There's a project coming up, so also we'll also have OG as well and many others. So in the comment section below, who else you want to see on the show, we'll be sure to bring them. Miale, thank you so much for hosting us. Yes. Yes, of course. Yes, tell them. And also where to get the me be neat. Kwanza mununue link jugush.ke ittnt123 na 4 ndio mjaji. Yeah, watch the show. I I buy the links. Why go me opiga jugu? Yo, you know, you link. Kwanza yeye ananunua 500. Yeah. Huyu si mtu atebei bae kwa hapo 200 100. <laughs> yeah, so get the link, watch the shows. I've watched all of them, and they are something, all right? Also, Manguo. See, you know, Manguo. Oh, guy, yeah, man, then the Mauza Masueta, need a good. You know, I don't think I can find you. I think I can find you. If you guys know the sweater, mm. you can get my sweater on the website, jugush.ke. Anything you want, jugush.ke. Guys, keep comment and thank you. And last but not least, guys, thank you for being our voice. Jumi Manze, sometimes Missy Juangi could be Gania. Ninim Nanipe Gania. Mungu akumbuke katika vita zenu. All right. Na niko na viatumbia guys. Ay ay ay. Comment, like and subscribe. We'll see you guys uh, next week same place same time. <laughs> Yesterday we had Gilad Milo. Watch the episode before this. Ali sema how you can make money from farming. For wale wanataka kuwa farmers, bro, that guy is making so much money from farming with about 350,000. You can make up to two, three, four, five million garlic farming. Kitungu saumu. Watch that one. Also, Prince Inda was on Kula Kula on Monday. Check that out. We'll see you guys next time. We're out. I'm also out.